Now that you've added computers and hypervisors, it is now imperative to add a monitor. Please note, we recommend adding the monitor to a server that is not running control up real time. Go to the settings tab on the top navigation bar and click monitor settings. The manage control up monitors window will pop up. Click on the add monitor button and click next. Now you will get the control up monitor installation wizard. Here you will choose the server where the monitor will sit. The monitor is a Windows service that provides 24-7 availability, incident trigger alerts, and data collection for historical reporting. You can either search for the server you want the monitor to sit on by scrolling through the list or enter the name in the search filter field. Please be aware that by default, the listening port, the port between the console and the monitor, is 40706. Be sure to verify that this port is open. Then press Next. Once the wizard verifies the connection and it is successful, press Next. The installation is now complete and you enter the configuration wizard. First you add valid domain credentials that can be used to automatically deploy agents to managed hosts and authenticate towards the managed computers. Provide the details, click OK, and then test the connection. In the next step, add the credential set in order to connect to your hypervisors. Once you click OK, you can validate the connection and then click Next. In the following screen, use the online default and click Next. In the proxy settings screen, use the system proxy settings unless your environment requires a change. Click Next to define your local SMTP server for incident trigger alerts. After inputting all the details, you can test the connection by sending yourself a test message. Click OK and then Next to get to the advanced settings. Here you can choose to regulate the information updates and click Next. Once the configuration wizard finishes, you can check the status and monitored resources. You can also see on the left pane at the bottom the monitor itself and the status upon completion has turned to a solid green icon.